I got a little dizzy right there. Yeah. Right, guys welcome back to the channel my name is Chris this is driven by boost and in today's showcase video we are featuring Brock's b9s4 right behind me which happens to be as of right now the world record stock turbo b9s4 so I'm super excited to have this car on the channel thank you Brock for bringing it out so in just a moment we're gonna go take it for a rip so stay tuned guys <laughs> Guys, welcome back. Uh, right next to me is Brock. Brock, thanks for coming out. Yep, man. not a problem. And we made his, it happen. Yeah, dude, definitely. Uh, we're in his B9S4, which is um, tuned by EPL, correct? Yep. EPL Stage 1. And it's got a whole bunch of other goodies on it. This car is the world record for the stock turbo, which is crazy. <laughs> it is. So I, I can't wait to go for a ride in this car. I've been, I've been waiting for a long time. We've just been having all the match our schedules up, but finally we're gonna do it, guys. Um, so besides the tune, we have a catless downpipe. Yep, catless downpipe. And then I have an ECS intake and a CTS front mount, and that's it for power mods. Nice, and then the beautiful new speed wheels. Yep and the big brake kit, which exactly. is gorgeous. And then, which is also a cool tidbit on the interior is the, you said those are S6, RS6? RS6, yep. He's got the RS6 pedal shifters, which are OEM bolt-on, which I think just look beautiful. They just look OEM plus, so. Yeah, they tie in perfectly with like all the other little accents of the silver trim and stuff, and they're not too big and bulky. They got a nice clicky feel to them so yeah this is it's, it's gorgeous man it fits right in and you got Thank the carbon you. fiber trim which is different from my car but yeah it's looking great i think uh we should take it for a ride let's go let's dude. do it yeah man the silver wheels they accent so well with the paint and then your trim as well i think it looks gorgeous yeah I, I definitely agree and like i thought about blacking out the trim around the window and everything i've done that in the past but okay it just it, it adds a nice little accent of not being you know everything black and offsets you know all the colors so yeah i like it really makes those big brake kit pop oh it's it like does spoke so it yep. looks bigger than it really is but yeah that they was... already are massive but it looks <laughs> even bigger by yeah it, that was know? my goal with that is i wanted to try and have something one that would be easy to clean in the winter um and two something that would you know show off the brakes yeah. more than a, a multi-piece wheel or multi-spoke wheel so these are your winter wheels yeah wow it's a it's a good looking winter setup I'll tell it you definitely that is yeah it's probably above what the average person would get for winter but yeah that was it was hard finding something that fit over the brakes and luckily um, my parts guy, I go through Nemesis Autosport. Okay. We reached out to so many wheel companies, had a measuring, you know, every possible solution, and New Speed came back and said they had some that fit. So, yeah, ended up doing it. <laughs> this catless downpipe sounds good. It does. That with the open intake. Three octane tune first. 
Uh, yeah, so actually, originally I had JB4. So I okay. started out with that, probably had that for, it was like 12,000 miles or so. And I ran that on 93 and E40. Um, it was nice, it did the trick, you know, it's a nice bump in power. Yeah. And this was yeah. during the time when nobody cracked open the ECU for this yet, so there okay. weren't any tunes available. Um, it was super nice to be able to pull it off when, anytime I take it into the dealer. Uh, but yeah, then once EPL came out with theirs, I just jumped straight to E40. So I, oh, nice. I barely tried their 93 octane tune. <laughs> okay, so in your in your first impressions really from you know JB4's 93 octane to the E40, was there a big difference? Oh in, yeah, in jump, yeah, definitely. So I think go right right here. Yeah, we'll go right. Here. Um, I think the fastest I've done on JB4 was like an 11.69 on okay. E40. And yeah, this is doing eleven three four. I felt the rear wheels just biting <laughs> yeah. back there, dude. Wow. Yeah, it was a huge improvement. Wow. Even just like the throttle response, the drivability everything was just greatly improved okay are you on e40 now yeah okay yep this okay. is pretty much all it's got yeah wow without going to like a hybrid turbo but i since this is my daily i don't really want to oh for sure um but yeah whenever you're ready uh brock's gonna give us a little launch for us guys um i'm excited to feel it so yes we can do this too we got, got the drag the, yeah i got the draggy in here even better to it. awesome um, yeah. all right guys we got the draggy set up trash control off you keep it in sport mode uh i do yeah okay. so i think when you put it into manual i don't know if you've heard of like amax shift is sh shift is shifts um it's basically a feature that with Audi, if it's in sport mode and dynamic, um, it sh it's like the fastest shift possible. Okay. So okay. that's typically the way you want to do it. If you're in manual, it disables that. So. Awesome. All right. Whenever good you're ready. there. All right, Brock's gonna send it. Oh, dude! <laughs> oh my God! Holy shit! <laughs> All right, I'm not gonna lie to you. I got a little dizzy right there. Yeah. That definitely took me by surprise. Yeah, I've, I've definitely oh, heard that a couple my times. My God, dude. So that wasn't even the quickest. That was a three six four. Oh. With like, yeah, ninety one percent incline, point nine one wow. incline. So definitely wow. not my best, but yeah, it it takes off. All right. Guys, I've been in some hard launching cars before, and this one is definitely in the top three. That one, that one made me feel dizzy like no other car has before. Dude, I'm not even kidding. Yeah, no, it rips. Oh man, I was totally not ready for that. Wow. <laughs> Holy cow. Yeah, I think my best is like a 3.3 .3 flat. Wow. Which is that's pretty quick still. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh, dude, that was nutty. That was crazy. And that's on snow tires too. On snow tires. Yep. Which is even more impressive when you think about right. that. Right. Which is probably why we felt the rear end slip. Yeah, dude, exactly. Which is crazy. Yeah, we were definitely breaking them free, that's for sure. Yeah. You want to wow. pull back in here? Yeah, let's pull back All in. Right. <laughs> I can't wait to watch the footage of that because I oh, think my eyes went in the back of my head. <laughs> <laughs> I was not ready for uh, that. Yeah, oh, yeah. Dude. I get my my oh girlfriend my loves gosh. when I launch it for some reason and she says it every time that she just completely feels her stomach drop. And... Yeah. All right guys, we're gonna grab Adriana. She's gonna join us for the launch. I think she should feel launch control just because of how awesome <laughs> it was. Let me go grab her real quick. All right guys, we got Adriana. She's gonna have a, a take at launch control with us. See if we can see any tire marks from when we ripped it. Probably, man. I think I, I think those are it right, right there. Right here, oh, yeah, I sure. think it is. Those are definitely ours. <laughs> <laughs> All right, maybe put your hazards on. Yeah. This guy's probably a lot here. I think you're clear behind us, so. All right. You got a full send. Oh, let's do it. Send it.
booty I've... hole clincher. <laughs> oh, for Ooh. sure. Uh, oh, I don't need to do my squats this week. <laughs> <laughs> there was like Ooh. a quick half second I stopped breathing, dude. That was nuts. Oh my god. Took your breath away. Yeah. Dang. It gave me that same feeling like there's this roller coaster ride uh, at Cedar Point and it's like a drag thing and it goes zero to 60. Oh yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, it did the same exact thing except like my booty hole clenched. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Yeah, how did that feel compared to the Golf R? I felt uh, unprepared. I think I was prepared for the golf R. Okay. You know, but this was like, oh no, it's like, yeah, it's. You weren't expecting it. Yeah, no, because you would never think of it like by looking at this car. You know? <laughs> but you yeah. definitely felt the force. Oh yeah. All right on. All right, Brock has graciously let me drive his S4. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. Um, yeah, this feels. Feels just like my car, yeah, but right. not really. Oh. Intake. Oh man. Like, <laughs> you're gonna make me spend so much money <laughs> in the S4, man, with this. Springs right great. Yeah. It's a good feel of the springs. Yep, it's not Real too soft, soft, not too stiff. The chassis and the V9s are just awesome. With with the uh the proper quattro with the you have the uh Sport differential too? I do, yep. Yeah, that is a game changer. Yeah, I actually have quite a bit of suspension stuff. So I got the springs, um, I got a rear sway bar, end links. Okay. The billet differential mounts, trans mount, subframe mounts, all from 034. Okay, and those make quite a bit difference? Yeah, yeah, it, it handles much better. Not that it was bad before, but. Jesus, dude! <laughs> oh my God, this thing has a mid-range mid-range punch just oh, tw yeah. twice as hard as a stock. Wow. All right. Yeah, it's not a cop. Okay. I'm gonna slow down and get a little more beeped up out of here if you don't mind. Do it. Uh, we're in sport. I'm not gonna launch it, but I'll do a hard a little hard run on Go it. Go for it. so weird i'll be back into my stock car and i'll drive it home like it's not gonna be the same uh, i've ruined man i've been i've been yeah. the apple there's no turning back from here boys awesome i think those are definitely cops though those are definitely cops <laughs> i think that is a good cue so for us to not, not rip, out here. Rip, rip out of here for sure but dude thanks you thank you so much man for yeah, bringing the problem. s4 out thanks for letting me rip it definitely definitely we're real. glad we can make it happen guys i will link Brock's Instagram in the description below. Be sure to check up on his build. Be sure to follow him. This S4 is definitely one of a kind. And it is truly, as of right now, a world record holder, which is pretty cool, man. It is. To it's have a cool that title. Feeling. <laughs> definitely is. Definitely enjoying it while it lasts. Yeah, for sure. For sure. All right, man. Well, cool. Yep. Yeah. Thanks Thank so much. Thank you. Take care. Yeah, guys, we will see you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching.